Hi there and welcome back to Wizardry 8, the Masters of Magic. We're once again here in the deep depths of Martin's Bluff, in the secret chambers behind, yeah, behind the, the uh, painting of Martin painting that asks you something. We're going to explore the rooms here because there's much and mighty loot here. And uh, yeah, let's let's just see what we'll find in this old wood-clad um, building. There's nothing here, it seems. Uh, An object. We have already something destroyed valuable. the strange guards that have been here. Yeah, the best kinet, but that's all too heavy for us. It's starting to get too heavy. Oh, we Something found valuable. a book. Nice. It's probably another of these portal books, so we can save uh, some of the spells. A spell picks, I mean. And use these books instead, which is pretty good. Now, let's see. These, the, these shelves are lined with leather-bound notebooks. You take one down and begin to flip through it. Each page contains thoughts and concepts you cannot begin to comprehend. You wonder whether this is the work of a genius or a madman. All of these. Interesting, yeah, so... Martin went Something mad. Valuable. An object. Yeah, Viper arrow is very nice. Something valuable. A hidden hammer, and what's that? The Schillach. I always don't know how to pronounce it. Let's take one walk back. And let's go to the next room now. And I have to activate my timer. It's not to make this too long. Because I need to go. And I also don't want to make it too short. <laughs> Sometimes the atmosphere is so dense that I think I've played like half an hour and it's only been like 10 minutes. Let's see. These books are filled with endless tables of figures. They could be account books or star charts or magical formulae. You have no idea. You never were much good with numbers. And you can't make heads or tails of any of the books on this shelf. They're all filled with strange symbols and diagrams you've never seen before. But you, you'd think all these intellectuals could make some sense, or could at least uh, talk nicely about it. But we'll see why that is maybe not the case. <gasps> An Eben Gem. Nice. I'll need that for the Eben stuff later. All the pages have been ripped out of this book. All but the last. The final page reads, They are coming for us. The bluff will fall to the HLL, the Higadi Lunar Legion, that is. Yet whatever happens to me, my knowledge will live on. Eternal trust survives the soul. You suddenly realize that this is Martin's diary, a last message from the man who stole the Destiny Dominus. A text of wisdom, by the way. A text of wisdom. Wasn't there something, some hidden way to escape here? Well, Martin didn't obviously die here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Eternal trust survives the soul. Very old, you see here. The wrinkles in the stone. I believe we should be able to find a, a brilliant helm down here. Why aren't we able to? Let's try this again. There should be something. Maybe our senses are too low. This is an outrage. Never missed that thing. right here should be able to see it but we don't see it I'm 
there is a helm. The only armor we have is that lone basket. It's a mystery. Well, let's go on and explore. I've been here, right? And what's going to be? This is a uh, Martin's tract. This is the entrance. Here should be Sadok. Yeah, let's 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 take a short visit to Sadok. Maybe he has new books, who knows? Do you have new books, Sadok? I was hoping I would see you soon. The watchers tell me that the Rapax are massing an army far north of here. They saw tents and guards, and they believe even the Rapax king himself. They were heading south. Be careful while you are out there, friends. So there should be the Rapax away camp now. Thanks, Sadok. Do you have new books, by the way? Oh, Book of Holding. Bought so much ammo from you, come on. And you're re only replacing ammo? I hate it. <laughs> Can we sell you some stuff? Yeah, that's good. Uh, the forest cape, of course. Potion of Superman, Granite Potion. Wow, there's a lot we have with us, though. <laughs> we will meet again, I am sure. Goodbye. Oh no, I oh, know. What what is there unidentified still? They wanna identify a bit. Let's Yeah, of course let's none practice it. A renewal potion that we made. Potion of cure disease. More potions of cure disease. More potions of cure disease. More potions of cure disease. And nothing. Portions of cure disease. <laughs> more portions of cure disease. And more portions of cure disease. And the book of removal. Oh, nice. Remove curse. It's time to have that. It's time. No, no, no. Book of remove curse. Nice. And we'll give that to whom, actually? Yeah, maybe to Xathrius, just for a change. Very good. Flora can learn a portal book. Ah, uh, not yet, not yet. Who else? Maybe there. None, maybe. Are you far enough? No. Studies evade you yet. What else to go for? Yeah, well, it's, let's just explore. Martin's Bluff is really nice to explore, so we'll do that. Don't always have to run streamlined, and I still want to find that helm I think I missed. A lot of potions too. Ah, more books. Take one of the books off the shelf and begin to read. The pages are densely packed with spidery handwriting. You can't make out much, 
The book seems to be about the three forces of the universe, knowledge, life and change. Something valuable. Something valuable. Nice. I think we should find everything, right? Three resurrection powders. It's just 6,000 here. Ha <laughs> ha. Something valuable. And more, and more. Finally, the brilliant helm. I'll I show it. it. Something I'll show valuable. it to you. Something valuable. In a short time. There it is. 20 intelligence and 6 armor class. Accessible to all and everyone. That's absolutely brilliant. It's just a little bit weighty. So... Hmm. Yeah, and you should basically usually give it to someone who has a very bad headgear to get the full bonus of it. So we could give it to our MOOC, but no, come on. We'll give it to Xathrius. He was the first character, so he'll go there with his 120 intelligence. <laughs> he'll blast everything down. <laughs> And so here you can find the brilliant hell if you if you'd like to go for it yourself and I would recommend it it's an item that you can use far into the late game and not find anything better and there and there a painting what is that the picture shows a man holding a glowing object outside a city gate. The scene reminds you of something, but you can't quite remember what. Well, this is the Arnica gate, and this is Martin <laughs> with his treasure. Well, let's look around here. This area is restricted. And you can move through here with a trick, but I'll have to look it up, and it seems like a little bit abusey, so... Only a little bit, though. Oh. Just don't want to do it now. We'll just continue here. In a normal way. So, are the Rapex, do you know something about what them? What have you found? Uh, nothing yet. I will await your return. Till we meet again. So nothing new. We need, yeah, the orbital coordinates of the savant. Ah, uh, so we need to go to Beijing find out about the other crash because we don't have access to the Umpani so we'll have to do that instead but first there is still some stuff to explore here in Martin's Bluff I mean this door don't quite remember how to Get in there. I forget it every time. So we'll just walk around here, find things ourselves again. Because we still need something there. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're coming near that. Totally good. We are totally good. Mm -hmm. we, we could go past there. Ah, if we only could jump, right? We only could jump. So that's here. Is there another way down here? Remember there was another way down? No. It's 
pretty creepy, I have to say. Let's go to the other direction. We'll find something there, I'm sure. Let's go to the other towers. I think there is... could pass through some kind of wall somewhere here. Oh. Bronze Greaves. Too heavy. I will have to go around. I think there was a secret entrance. Wow, that fight, that fight. Whoa, and the fight of my little ones with sleep. That's also a thing for itself. Whew. If sleep was an enemy. Now, um, we have a fight against six Thresher Apuses. Is this a good cliffhanger? What do you think? <laughs> I'll need to end. I need to end the episode for now because it's terribly late now, and I need to sleep. Uh, so, thank you for watching. Happy gaming to you, and uh, hopefully, you will have better luck next time. <laughs> Have a good time until then.